dear students we are discussing about the gene and their expression now we will study about the cells using rna to make proteins now all organisms they have a basic mechanism the mechanism is about reading and expressing a particular gene now this whole mechanism is known as central dogma or central doma now the whole genetic information it is present inside dna okay which is the main fountain head all information will originate from that fountain the genetic information will flow into the rna and then it is converted into proteins now the first step this is known as gene expression and it is divided into two steps the first step is transcription and the second step is translation now the gene expression begins with transcription the first step of central doma or central dogma is the transfer of information from dna information is transferred from dna to rna and it includes the formation of a messenger rna copy of the genes means the dna is uh, or that particular sequence of the dna is copied in the form of messenger rna or mrna the copy of gene is produced this process this whole process is known as messen uh, transcription dna transcription which means the formation of a messenger rna copy of the dna now transcription will be started when the enzyme rna polymerase there will be an enzyme rna polymerase which is controlling this whole process it binds to particular site on the promoter promoter is the point before the gene rna polymerase will be attached to promoter so this will be promoter is something or the points before the gene the gene to be copied the enzyme then moves along the strand of the gene and the messenger rna is synthesized means uh, from promoter to the gene it moves in the direction and the messenger rna is formed and at the end of the gene there is a stop signal which will ultimately stop the whole process the enzyme will disengage or separate from the dna and it will release the newly synthesized messenger rna chains the chain is complementary transcript of the gene or it is the copy of the gene from which it was copied now the second step is translation it is the second step of the central doma transfer of information now the information is transferred from rna to proteins which this uh, this whole process will occur when the information which is contained in the messenger rna it will be used to direct the synthesis of polypeptides now this messenger rna has information this information will be sent to ribosomes the ribosomes will collect the amino acids and will form polypeptides and this whole process is known as translation we will see the details of these uh, processes both the transcription and translation in detail because the nucleotide sequence of messenger rna is translated into an amino acid the the whole information from this gene this gene which was copied this gene was copied into messenger rna it will indicate which amino acid is required now this will this messenger rna will tell the recipe to ribosomes the ribosomes will then 
collect the amino acids and the amino acids will be joined to form the polypeptides and ultimately the required protein sequence is obtained this is whole process of gene expression now let us see the types of rna